Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to Prophecy Box Breaks for Season 4, Episode 36. Tonight we are looking at 2024 Panini Prism WWE Undercard. We're going to do a very quick treasure hunt through Undercard tonight. It will be our first ever treasure hunt through Undercard. Three of us are chopping the box, so we're going to do a real quick draft of packs, and then we are on our way. Now, since I'm present and they are not... They are going to be drafting their packs, and I'm going to be taking the leftovers. The pack with the autograph in it is going to be a wild card pack, and we will be randomizing for that pack at the very end of our break. So we're going to go ahead and pull these out here. I'm trying to pull them all out in order. There we go. Empty box. Packs. Let's move this over here. Okay, so fellas, listen up. These are your packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Steve, you won the lottery for the first pick in the draft. Please draft a pack. Six. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so that's six. So now one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. RJW. Steve, I'm putting it right over here to the side. RJW wants three. Same thing. Steve. Steve wants four. RJW. Again, same thing, over and over, zigzag. RJW wants five. Steve, draft your last pack. Two, RJW, same thing, zigzag, draft your last pack. Three, now. From where we stand, if one of these four packs has the autograph, I believe it's this pack. So I'm going to put this pack here. That's our wild, uh, our wild card pack, which means these are mine, these are RJ's, and these are Steve's. Any hits, we're going to put them up here in the same fashion so that I can keep, uh, uh, keep a, an easy track of them. When we find the autograph pack, if it is not this pack, it will take the place of this pack. We will be randomizing that pack between the three of us at the end of the break to, to determine who gets the additional fourth pack. Any last questions, gentlemen, those of you present in chat, any last questions at all before we get started? If not, give me a thumbs up from our draftees and we will get started. All right, excellent. Thumbs up. Here we go, gentlemen. We're going to start with RJW, go to me, and then go to Steve. Ultimately, reverse the order uh, that, that, well, I guess not exactly reverse order drafted, but RJW, pack number one. Remember, unless this is the autograph pack, this pack is yours. Good luck, buddy. Pack number one starts off with our truth Let me adjust the lighting. Nope, that's actually about the best. Okay, our truth. Nathan Frazier. Caden Carter. Sol Ruka. Adam Pierce. Josh Briggs, Elton Prince, all right, now these dots signify uh, undercard exclusive, so these are only available 
through WWE undercard. We have a WrestleMania moment with The Undertaker. Very nice. Let's take a peek at that. Uh, do, 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 do. WrestleMania 27 showdown with Triple H is high on that list. Battling for more than a half hour in a no holds bar match. We'll sleeve him up in just a moment. Finally in that pack, you also have Paul Ellering in the undercard exclusive. One of the most legendary managers of all time. Nice finds, RJ. Nice first pack. And it's always nice to find a parallel of The Undertaker. Let's adjust this real quick here. There we go. All right. Pack number two is mine. Oops. I'm going to put the cards that we pulled back into your pack here. Come on. There we go. All right, pack number two. Nice, pack number two starts off with the ninth wonder of the world, China. There's the base, Paul Ellering. Ludwig Kaiser. The Ultimate Warrior. Terry Bam Bam Gordy. Ken Shamrock. Isla Dawn. Look at that interesting. It's like a uh, broken glass or a shattered glass parallel, maybe? Considers herself a modern day witch. Maybe that's just the way they wanted her photo to appear. I like that. That's cool. Yeah, I like that. Even if it's just her base card, that's a that's a great design. Now we are gonna flip this because we have a surprise. We have what appears to be our first hit of the day. With a oh nice, a red parallel of Terry Bam Bam Gordy. With the undercard exclusive dots. Giving a 40 of 99. 40 of 99 for the WWE legend. Our first numbered find of the break. And behind him is a Ultimate Warrior parallel of the undercard exclusive. There you go. That is a little bit thicker than the others. Okay, let me pack these back up. And first pack for Steve L. Steve, thanks so much for participating in today's break. Thanks for making the live show, buddy. Appreciate you very much. Good luck on your first pack. That is Rhea Ripley with the war paint on. Very nice. Bailey. Look at that. Two women's champions back to back. Johnny Gargano. CM Punk. Nia Jax, who I believe is currently the women's champion, or one of the women's champions. Jimmy Uso. The Rock.
I bet that's the most valuable base we've found so far. We have a WrestleMania moment. Oh my goodness, it's Roddy Piper boxing Mr. T. That is so freaking cool. Dude, nice find. Nice card. And your second exclusive is... Oh my god, it's Liv Morgan. Yes. This pack was so full of divas. I don't even know if they call them divas anymore, but they should. If they don't, they should. Um, we'll put her here. And put your WrestleMania moment up top with Taker. I bet that rock, even the, the base, I bet the rock base sells for a few bucks by itself. Rock stuff is so hot right now. Yes! Move over, Dirty Dom. <laughs> All right. We're going back to RJ. RJ, wake up. It's pack number two, buddy. Pack number two starts off. I, that's funny. I thought it was Dom. Raquel Rodriguez. Sean Spears. Seth freaking Rollins rocking the title belt. Chelsea Green. Naomi. Devon Dudley. The almighty Bobby Lashley. I think that's the coolest base card we've seen so far. Oh, oh, we have a red exclusive. Natalia, Natalia Neidhart, very nice. Your red is numbered 98 of 99. Very nice blue, RJ. And we have a Joe Coffee exclusive. RJ fall asleep on us? Where'd he go? Packing up his cards. Oh, there he is. All right. Whoop. All right. Second pack from my stack. A lot of cards in these are kind of creeping up towards the bat or the the top of the pack. So. Zoomed in on Liv Morgan's card and got distracted. We got scripts starting off my second pack. Nikolai Volkov. Wow. Loose Cannon Brian Pillman. Now, I didn't get to see a whole lot of Brian Pillman in WWF aside from the Stone Cold Steve Austin incident. But I followed his career when he was breaking through in WCW and definitely loving the things that his kid is doing as well. So uh, this is an awesome one for me to pull. This is a, a base card that will go into my collection. It, it'll be the first Brian Pillman card I've pulled in a very, very long time. Hulk Hogan. Meechin. My packs have not had a lot of divas in them. 
We got Carl Anderson. Grayson Waller. Ooh. Prismatic ex uh, prismatic entrances. Exclusive. Triple H. That is gorgeous. That is not numbered. However, I guarantee you the next card is numbered. John Cena. Gold. Exclusive. Oh, wow. Bookend number 10 of 10. Holy cow. That is the pull of the break so far. That is gorgeous. Oh, shaking a little bit there. Just a little. That is a beautiful card. Not to put down the Triple H prismatic entrances, but boy, oh boy. Yeah, yeah, definitely. With with Cena retiring at the end of this next year, now's the time to... I, I, that That's the first Cena that I have in my collection. Now's the time to pull him. Steve... Your second pack, again, barring it being the autograph pack. Steve starts off with Piper Niven. Noam Dar. L.A. Knight, currently the United States Champion. Yeah. Indy Hartwell. Andre Chase. Ivy Nile. Again, way more divas than I get. The Great Kali. Ooh, we got some shiny. There you go. That's a little bit more older school. John Cena. Nice find, Steve. We got some color. Not this time. That is, ooh, that is Alba Fire. Oh, she's got a print line. That is unfortunate. I don't know if you can... Right right there, can you see it? Right here? It's doubled up on top here. There, you can really see it. Uh, well, it's a nice card for your PC. Not, not necessarily one that's going to make you anything on the market. Yeah, that's very much a Doctor of Thugonomics card. Or, or, uh, or, uh, uh. Look, anyway. All right, putting these back in your package here. This is just so I don't accidentally mix them up and then have to go through the video and resort cards pack by pack by pack. We did a pretty good job of not pulling the uh, autographs, at least at the end of the draft. Let's go ahead and go back to RJ. Third pack for RJ again, unless it's the auto pack. Carmelo Hayes. Angelo Dawkins. Jakara Jackson. Now either that's our first rookie card or I have simply missed the rookie badge. Which I suppose is possible, but I think that's our first rookie card. The Road Dog, Jesse James.
Oh, my personal favorite, Alexa Bliss. Ren Sinclair, rookie. Shotzi, see another pack full of divas. Full of divas. All right. Your exclusive is an emergent insert of Trick Williams. The unfortunate part here is, isn't this guy in AEW now? I, 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 maybe, maybe, yeah, he is, right? Is that um, Trick Williams? Is that uh, is that Swerve Strickland? Or am I confusing him with another guy? Because I know Swerve Strickland was a WWE guy. But I didn't, I never saw him in WWE. I only saw him in AEW. Behind Trick, you have, oh nice, Earthquake. Very nice. Legend status. Alright, let's sleeve these up. Oh, he's an NXT. Okay, so I am I am confusing him. Trick uh, uh, Swerve was somebody else then. Okay. It's like, well, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know who he was in WWE then. This pack is weird. This pack is vacuum sealed weird. And I'm going to go out on a limb and say that this pack has the autograph in it. It was different than the others. Yep, right there. I bet that's the autograph right there. That bright card. Okay, let's find out. Let's find out. Again, if it's the autograph pack, then I'll be swapping it out for this pack right here. We have rookie Tank Ledger. Kevin Owens, Gunther, Intercontinental, well, former Intercontinental Champion, Channing, Stax, Lorenzo, Omos, Fallon, Henley, Oh, I thought it was going to be, I thought the Roman Reigns was going to be the auto, man. Roman Reigns. It's got to be the next card here. It's upside down. Oh, no, no. It's, it's, a re it's a redemption. It's a little disappointing. It's definitely a redemption behind Roman Reigns. I'm just going to make sure it's not one that shows the code. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong side. No, it doesn't. Okay, so I'm going to set it here for a second right here. We have Ludwig Kaiser as your exclusive. And behind Roman, Sensational Signatures, Prism Undercard, card number six. Oh my God, it's an autograph of Jerry the King Lawler. So awesome. One of us is going to get a Jerry the King Lawler autograph. Now, as we mentioned, this card now or this pack now goes into the randomizer. So I'm going to take that pack down because that one's going to become mine. Um, I'm going to put Kaiser back here in the middle to make sure that he's protected. It will still get sleeved up once I do the sleeve. I'm, I'm probably going to um, package all the cards up and everything tomorrow. Um, or the day after tomorrow, after our break. So this is now uh, the, the lottery pack. We'll put it right there. This now becomes my third pack. I knew it. The way that it was 
it was vacuum sealed weird. That card wasn't as big as the others. It was just a lot of, it was a lot of, yeah. I can't believe it's a Jerry Lawler auto. That's so great. Bronson Reed. Acom. Zoe Stark. Miss Elizabeth. Oh my goodness. I did not know they were putting Miss Elizabeth in sets. That is awesome. Carmen Petrovic, rookie. I must have just missed the rookie badge earlier. Wes Lee. Scarlet. Your first exclusive is a Rumble performance. Hulk Hogan hoists consecutive crowns. And that looks like Earthquake. Not numbered. I had to check because of the black interior. I had to double check. And we also have an exclusive of Dijak, who I'm not familiar with, out of NXT. Oops, oops, that's my stack. Pardon me. And I will pack these up. Steve's got that last pack magic, and then we will go to the randomizer. Good luck, pal. Find that one of one. Alba Fire is our first duplicate. Oh, no, you have the exclusive version of her. Never mind. That's cool. You got both. Rookie, Adriana Rizzo. Solo, Sokoa. Diamond, Dallas Page. Julius Creed. Shayna Basler, Candice LeRae. Oh, look at that beautiful, exclusive prismatic entrances of Liv Morgan. Bro, you hit both Liv Morgan exclusives. And this one is just gorgeous. Not numbered, but oh my goodness, that's beautiful card. Behind her, we have, look at that, Becky Lynch in the cell. Uh, and also, Steve, I want you to be aware that if you're interested in moving it, I bet I know somebody who would snap this card right up. Just, just so you know, if you're interested, let me know. And I think they might just love to add it to their collection. They've got more Becky Lynch autographs than I've ever seen a person have autographs of a single person. So they just might be interested. Sorry, there was a little bug. There we go. So, but, oh man, the prismatic entrances is gorgeous. I'm going to put the rest of your base in this pack. And then we're going to go over here to the randomizer. We're going to spin it one time. There you go, Steve. Let me make sure I've got it loaded. Here we go. It is still set to Steve from earlier. He won the randomizer to go first in the draft. Good luck, gentlemen. The winner of the auto and auto pack is... Oh my god, it's close. It's so close. Oh my god, it's RJ! Oh! I was holding my breath. I thought it was going to be me. Congratulations, RJ, on your Jerry the King Lawler autograph. That is going to be absolutely phenomenal. And I'm going to teach you how to take pictures of cards so that when it comes in, you can give us a good picture. 
instead of those scrubby pictures you always post your sideways and upside down pictures of your cards. So thank you so much everybody for stopping by and checking out Prophecy Box Breaks today. If you hung out this long, hang out a little bit longer, hit one of those buttons down below, pop a comment in, let me know which hit you thought was the best. And uh, check us out, man. Every Tuesday, we are here. This is a Monday, but every Tuesday, we are here ripping and tearing through packs. Come check us out. Have a great evening, everybody. We will see you tomorrow.